The Hawks took a rough injury to one of their key players on Saturday, after he was pushed into an open goal, sliding over four exposed metal bolts at Anne Stadium Sydney. Scrapping over the rusted metal spokes during the third quarter of the game, Jared Ruffy Ruffied, tore his jumper, exposing deep red bruises on his back from the impact. Hawthorne Hawks coach Alastair Clarkson told Fox Sports that he has raised concerns over the quick changeover between NRL and AFL games which could have resulted in a more serious injury to Ruffied. This venue has got its challenges, said Mr. Clarkson. And stadium management have launched an investigation after the incident and said when the fence line was moved back to accommodate the required 5-meter zone behind the goals for this game, the holding bolts were exposed. Mr. Clarkson went on to tell Fox Sports, it's hardly ideal preparation for a top-level clash between two really good sides, but there is no other ground in the league which has to prepare for two different codes in two days. I suppose that's why everybody's preference is for the Sydney cricket ground rather than this oval he said. The stadium hosted an NRL match on Friday night, the bolts being used to secure an emergency fire extinguisher, said one and stadium spokesperson to Fox Sports. Despite the setback, the Hawks made a comeback with a crushing 89-point win over the Sydney Swans during Saturday's game. As the first game since removing a melanoma from his lip, Ruffied made an impressive five goals throughout the game. The exposed bolts were covered with rubber matting to avoid further injury, but resulted in another player slipping over in an almost comical turn of events. And stadium staff hope to be better prepared for future games on their grounds.